Originally, the idea from this piece came from Sister Mary Scullion of Project Home. She knew that Mary Undur of Knots was one of his favorite paintings, and not being the symbol of universal struggle, perhaps. It's been used in, in many cultures throughout time. Uh, she has always liked that painting as well. Uh, so she came and said, what about Mary Undur of Knots? And then I thought, we don't want to just repaint it. We thought, well, what can we do with these knots? Archbishop Chapeau in Philadelphia, recognizing that the Pope would be here for the World Media families, he wanted a special emphasis on the poor. And so he established the Committee for Hunger and Homelessness um, for the World Meeting of Families in honor of Pope Francis's spirit. To participate, you can, from now until when the Pope comes uh, to Philadelphia, you can submit on a website, mercyandjustice.org. It's all one word. You go there and you push one button, submit not, and type it in. Then we have a scribe here in the studio um, who will write your email, who will write it onto a prayer slip, and then that will be woven with everyone else's struggle. So it then becomes a collective struggle and prayers for those struggles. Of the 10 largest cities in the country, Philadelphia is one of the 10 largest cities in the United States. We have the highest poverty rate. I mean, it's, you know, uh, I mean, I think the predominant cause of, of homelessness is, is poverty. People cannot afford a place to live. People cannot afford the utilities, you know, the other costs associated with maintaining a, a home. And we work with people who are living on the streets to bring them in, to bring them home. We have a igloo-like frame that is made out of cedar wood. Within the igloo, um, on the ground, there will be a, a reflecting pool where we will have the image of the original painting reflecting on the water. So you can come into the grotto, walk around. It's set up so that you can experience the grotto on the site of the basilica. Everyone may experience something different, but I would want people to experience something significant and something telling in their individual relationship to all of the struggles. And perhaps there's an awareness that comes out of that. <laughs>